So I just wanted to pop on here and tell you that God is good. He is faithful. He loves you. He has a plan for your life. Do not give up whenever you are feeling hopeless, young child. Old child, whatever age you are, do not give up. He is testing you. He is putting you through trials. He is testing you. He wants to see if you are going to be faithful to him or if you're going to go back to your old fleshly ways, child. He wants to know that you are going to follow him and not follow this world. He is good and he is faithful. God made you in your mother's womb. He made you. He knows every single hair on your head, as it says in the Bible. He knows every single thing that's going to happen to you. It's already happened in his eyes. He knows. He knows how you're going to respond to certain things. He knows your weaknesses. Okay, so don't ever for a second, for a second, think that he doesn't love you and that he does not know what's going on in your life. The father of all creation has made you beautifully and wonderfully, perfectly made for how you are for the purpose he has given you. And you need to dive into his word, dive into who our father is so that you can discover the plan that he has for your life. It's so crazy because sometimes we forget who God is and we blame him for certain things that have happened to us when the reality is we do not need to do that and you have no right to do that because he made you. You didn't or you didn't have a choice to live on this earth. He made you beautifully, wonderfully made. Your talents, your desires, the things that make up who you are, he placed within you and he loves you so much. And he's just waiting for you to step out on faith and for you to meet him halfway because he wants to help you. So if you're feeling if you're feeling doubtful, if you're feeling lost, if you're feeling broken, if you're feeling hurt, if you're feeling like he's forgotten about you? He hasn't. Sometimes God will pull away so that we dive into him more. Okay, he created the universe. He created the world. He created everything. He can handle the problems in your life if you let him. So don't give up. Don't go back to those old habits that you had done before. Don't go back to your fleshly desires. Don't, don't go back to doing all that stuff that you know he's telling you not to do. Because whenever you make it, whenever you listen to him and whenever you obey him, there will be blessings and he will reward you for obeying him. And you don't want to go back to living in that sin either. You don't want to go back to those things that, that made you feel distant from him. You know right from wrong. You know what's godly and what's not godly. And if you don't, I encourage you to join a small group, open up your Bible, dive into the word. How can we understand what the word is if we don't be if we're not reading it? I love you guys so much. Thank you for watching. I just wanted to encourage you and um continue to tell you what the truth is because the truth is that and that Jesus loves you. Jesus died for you and he has a plan for your life. Don't give up. Dive into him. I love you guys. Praying for you and I hope you have a wonderful week. Just sitting in my car. Just sitting in my car, my car.